guys, it's Kylie, and in today's video, I have an Easter pin tag. So happy Easter, and in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing an Easter pin tag. This is a pin tag put together by the Siskateers, and it's sharing off a bunch of different pins to represent Easter and the, the different themes around Easter. But if you guys are interested in more Disney videos just like this, definitely the subscribe button, turn on the bell so you get notified every time I upload, I post tons of Disney content on this channel. And definitely check out all the different channels participating in this tag in the description down below. I will have all their channels linked for you to check out their videos and to see what pins everybody picked for this tag. I love these videos because it's so much fun to see what everybody picked and which ideas everybody comes up with just based on the different categories for the tag. So now let's dive in and see what pins I picked. So the first pin is New Life and it's show a pin of a baby. And for this I decided to go with a pin of Winnie the Pooh as a baby. So this is the pin. It has Winnie the Pooh with his honey pot and it's a little baby Winnie the Pooh sticking his hand in his honey pot trying to get out all the delicious honey. I just thought this was a fun pin as a baby. I don't have any like with a baby as like a human but I thought I had some awesome characters character baby pins and this one was definitely one of the cutest pins so I decided to go with that. The next one is Easter baskets and it's show a pin you received as a gift and I decided to go with this Toy Story Mania pin. My sister got this for me one year while we were in Disney. It was when I first started collecting pins. He can take, Mr. Potato Head can take his ear off so it's got an awesome moving element to it and it's just a fun pin that my sister got me because it's one of our favorite rides. So I thought this would be a fun one to show for a pin I got as a gift as as somebody did get this for me as a gift on one of our Disney trips. The third one is springtime and it's show a pin with flowers on it and I can't think about Disney and flowers without thinking about flower and garden so I decided to go with this flower and garden Mickey and friends seed company pin. This is from I believe last year's flower and garden or two years ago flower and garden. I just think it's a such an awesome pin. It's got a lot of different vegetables on it. It's a fun rose gold color and there's also an awesome pin on pin element with the Mickey and then the flower and garden festival words behind it and it's definitely a fun flowery springtime pin. I just think the flower and garden is like when I think of spring and I think of Disney flower and garden is the first thing that comes to mind so I couldn't not include a flower and garden pin for a category of springtime. It is definitely what Epcot is in the spring and totally represents those flowers and everything that happens at Disney in the spring. The flower and garden goes all the way from the beginning of March all the way through the whole season of spring so it definitely is springtime at Disney. Number five is candy and it's show a food pin. I don't have any candy specific pins but I do have a bunch of food pins and for this I decided to go with this donut shop pin. This is the Chippendale donut shop pin. You got two different donuts on the front and it actually does open up and then inside you have a bunch more donuts. So you have a bunch of awesome Chippendale donuts and it definitely represents food. And who doesn't love different donuts and what donuts are? I love donuts. I love having donuts in the morning. So I definitely thought that was a fun food one and it's still kind of a sweet treat like candy is to have on Easter. The fifth one is egg hunts and this is to show a pin you hunted for and I couldn't not go with this boo pin. I had this boo pin on my in search of list for literally like five or six years. It has a puffy vinylmation element to it so it's a three-dimensional pin. I just think it's such a cool pin and boo has a lot of meaning to me so I definitely had to find this pin and add it to my collection. I also really like the look of the puffy vinylmation pins. I think they're a cool element where they have that 3D-ness to them and because boo has such an important meaning to me and I love boo in her monsters outfit in that purple monsters outfit I definitely wanted to have that pin in my collection so when I came across that pin I saw it on an Instagram sale I immediately jumped on it. I knew I wanted to have that for my collection. The sixth pin in this is pastels and it's show a pin with some pastel colors and since this is an Easter pin tag I thought I had to include at least one Easter themed pin. So this one's the best of both worlds. It's an Easter pin with pastel colors with Chippendale so it actually has some younger Chippendale on it with an Easter egg. This is actually Easter 2006. It's got a nice pastel colors on the egg and in the background with the flowers in the sky. 
I just thought it was a super cool Easter pin. And I do love all the different Disney Easter pins that they come out with. I think Chip and Dale make an awesome Easter pin. And this one definitely represents that pastel colors. It was definitely a cool pin. And when I thought of pastels, this is the first pin that I saw. And I was like, that pin is perfect for it. And it also represents Easter. And I really wanted to have an Easter pin in this tag. So the seventh one is faith and it's show a pin that represents your faith and I didn't know exactly what to do for this I don't have a specific faith that I follow so I decided to actually go with a pin that kind of shows like my path in life and where I'm going in the future and I know that's a lot around faith of like what your life is going to be so I actually went with a sports theme pin and I went with this pin because it has volleyball and basketball which are two big sports for me volleyball is where I'm getting my coaching experience and starting off my coaching career basketball was what I grew up with and probably what I'm going to coach in the future and sports in general is just like the path I want to take as a career so that's kind of where I went with this I have lots of sports I grew up on sports I watch sports I just love sports sports I have a whole nother channel on sports so I thought sports was kind of what I'd represent for my faith and I didn't have like a specific Disney theme that I felt like represented a faith I don't follow a certain like religion or anything so sports is definitely like where a big part of my life is and big path in my life is so I decided to go with that instead and the last one is Easter Bunny and it's show an animal theme pin or a rabbit theme pin if you have one and I have one that has some animals and a rabbit on it so this is actually a cool pin this is one of an limited edition pin from a couple years ago one of the monthly release pins and on the front it is this metal look and it has Br'er Rabbit on the front so that's my Easter Bunny represents the rabbit and then when you open it up it has some of the birds and the boat in the inside from Splash Mountain I just thought this was a cool pin. It had Rare Rabbit on the front to represent the Easter Bunny and then also had some other animals. So it still represented other animals as well, but it represented that Easter Bunny with Rare Rabbit. So those are the eight different pins that I chose for this tag. Thank you for the Sisketeers for putting this together. Happy Easter to everybody. I think this was a super fun tag getting to show off different Easter themed pins and some of the ideas around Easter. Definitely check out everybody's videos in the description down below and everybody that's participating in this tag and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did and if you want to see more Disney videos on this channel and I will see you guys later. Bye!